I don't really get leads any other way. So I don't run Facebook ads or even the traffic to my, my website where the podcast and the membership sites hosted on the same site. But most of the traffic are members or their listeners of my podcast that want to get on my email list. So they're not, there's just not, it's for members, generally speaking. And <clears throat> sorry about that. Little throg, frog in my throat. But um, so that, that's kind of how that works. But on the site itself, I don't, and I open, I open it periodically. So people can't just join all the time. And so I'll do a public opportunity to join twice a year. And I'll, I'll mention that on the podcast as well as to my email list. And then, then they'll join from that. And then actually just this month, when, once I see the waiting list start to get larger, I'll, I'll send out a, just out a private invitation to, to just to that email list or members that are on the waiting list and bring them in that way. And, and that allows me to really to control the growth. So I don't get too many members in at any one time and, and get overwhelmed because I mean, they'll, they'll have questions and, and it's, and it's easier for me psychologically too. And I, and I thought about this the other day, cause I did a, a membership, just sort of this private invite and, and it was good, but I, I offer monthly, I offer annual and with an annual I offer a 30 day guarantee. And, you know, somebody joined and they just realized that they weren't a good fit. They weren't going to have enough time and they asked for a refund, which, you know, when you have a membership site, at least for me, it just stinks, right? I mean, it's part of the process. You, you expect people to, to quit and, and ask for refunds, but it still stings. It's almost like it'd be better if they didn't join, but when they join and ask for a refund. And so by just opening it several times a year, that, that emotion of, now, did somebody join today? Did somebody join today? I can just do it. I can batch it. I can batch the, the pleasure of people joining and I can batch the, you know, having to give an occasional refund, which, which actually doesn't happen that month much. You know, my typical launch refunds will be maybe three to 5%, generally speaking, and, and which, you know, it's, it's acceptable.